Hey YouTube, what's up? Village here. Hi you guys. So, um, this is kind of a touchy court casey thing. Um, I am going to be... Okay, so I know you just wanted me to do a regular court case, but I meditated on it and Ikate really wants me to put him in the freezer. Um, it's kind of like a timeout and um, it'll help um, stop him um, from proceed like a cease and desist, you know? Um, but only a witch's cease and desist, not an attorney's cease and desist. My cease and desist. Anyways, so I've already got his picture and petition filled out and um, ready to go. Um, and so I'm going to be soaking him in here. And then I'm going to take him out and put him in a plastic bag and wrap him up in a piece of foil. And then he will go in the freezer. Then on this candle, I have some court case herbs. And I already have your petition filled out with your pictures. And then I'm going to be writing all over this saying lots of nice things about you. And, you know, that I want the judge to find favor on your behalf, so on and so forth. And you guys just turned off my ghost radio. Hmm. That's okay. Anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. The first thing I'm gonna do is fold this up like this. I need like, I don't wanna touch it, it's nasty. Some nice little um, needle nose pliers. Wait, who that stinks? Okay, got a plastic bag right here. Let's get it ready. Lucifer. All right. I'm gonna burn these, catch them on fire a little bit, get that stuff off of there. To, um, I'll write, I'm going to write his name on here. I'm going to get rid of this because I don't want this getting in your stuff. And his name is Cease and desist. Right here for now. And then I'm going to start on yours. Um, I like to use the blue candles for the court cases. And... Um, I like to use these ones better than the taper candles. I used to use the taper candles and then do not magic on it and everything, but they don't 
burn for as long and these I can let them burn for like a whole for like days and I don't have to put them out they just burn and burn and um, I like that and so I like I like to use these ones for that reason just because I don't have to put them out and they could just keep on keep on burning all right Okay, one more and then we'll get them. I'm gonna put dad's name on here. Perfect. Um okay. So I usually do all of my, I like to do all my court cases with um, King Billy L. He is um, an ancient god that I work with. And so um, he's really good, he's really good, he likes to do court cases. He does everything with me. But um, I'm going to draw his sigil on the foil. I feel like I'm missing a circle. Oh, that's fine. It goes right here. There we go. Okay, and one more thing that I need to do. Where's my little thing? Um, I have to give him an offering and so is what I will do is um, get one of those little diabetic pin things and I poke my finger and I put it right there my blood goes right there and then that's his offering for the spell get a little witch's blood on there gives it some extra kick just a little bit See, just those little diabetic things, super easy to use, doesn't really hurt or anything, you know, it's just, ow! No, just kidding. <laughs> Shh. 
just kidding. It didn't hurt. I put that right on his beautiful sigil. It's quite lovely. Okay, now then. Court case herbs coming right up. Putting, I put a, a little drop on your petition, and now I'm adding your court case herbs over the top of my blood. And then I'll put your picture over the top of that. And then that, this will go over the top of um, Belial Sigil, Belial. And then we're going to roll this all up in the foil. So you kind of got a twofer because I went ahead and put the attorney, I'm putting the attorney in the freezer. Um, I just felt like that's what Ikate wanted me to do. And therefore, that is where you shall go. And if at a later time, if you think it's when all of this blows over, if you will, when it all gets resolved, if you guys want him out of the freezer, you can just give me a call, email me, and let me know if it's affecting him or whatever. Then you can let me know, and I'll take it out if you want. Or his ass can stay in there until I die. I don't care. It's up to you. Um, I have special sigils on my, this is my, um, it's a copper tray that I use. It's my casting tray is what I call it, or my casting table. And um, I'm going to write your initials on here. And then when it's done, I'll do a reading on one of my live chats in a few days. We'll see how it did. I'm just going to put EK and TK. I'll put court up here. Court case. All right, that looks beautiful. Candles burning really weird. Did you see that? It's because of my blood. Because I put the offering on there. I didn't put it on the can on the wick or anything though. So that's interesting. All right, so I'm gonna wrap this up on here like so. Piece of tape. And let's tape it on there. Hmm. I usually have tape right there. Oh, I bet I took it over to the other side, huh? Well, that's okay. Hmm. That's all right. Um, and we'll just use this.
so um, in my freezer, in my freezer potion that I soaked him in in that jar, um, it is. There's a lot of different things in there that are supposed to like stop him in his tracks. Um, and yeah, it's really good stuff. Um, I don't think Hecate wants me saying what's in there. Okay. She doesn't like me to give out my secret to you guys. I know, um, I had a subscriber was complaining the other day that, oh, you're doing such a great job, sweetheart, but we don't know what you're doing. How are we supposed to do it? Um, <laughs> so whenever I think I'm going to tell you guys how to do it and things like that, Hecate wants you guys to ask her yourself because that's how I learned it. So she wants you to learn it from her too. So anyway, you guys, I'm going to get off of 